Hello, I'm Roger Reimer, director of the Bethel College Maybe Observatory. I'd like to introduce my daughter, Chelsea Woodland, who will be reading the first in a series of astronomy-themed bedtime stories that she created for her boys, Malcolm and Max. Please enjoy the story of Nebby the Nebula. Once upon a time, in the far, far reaches of space, there was a beautiful, colorful cloud named Nebby. Nebby was not just any cloud, it was a special space cloud called a nebula. You see, nebulas are like nurseries for stars, places in space where stars are born, glowing with all the colors of the rainbow because of the gases and dust they contain. One day, Nebby felt a little lonely out there in space. Despite its bright colors and the sparkling light it spread across the dark sky, it wished for friends to share its beauty with. So Nebby decided to create stars, little lights that could keep it company and brighten up the sky even more. Nebby, nebulas like Nebby play a crucial role in the universe. They gather dust and gas from around themselves, squishing them together with gentle care until poof, a star is born. But something unexpected happened. A dark shadow loomed over, making everything around Nebby cold and scary. This shadow was a space monster that loved to swallow light, making the space around it very dark. This monster can be thought of like a black hole, a place in space where gravity pulls so much that even light cannot get out, making it look like a giant space monster that swallows everything around it. The little nebula felt scared and worried that it wouldn't be able to create its star friends. But Nebby remembered that it had the ability to make stars shine bright. Gathering all its courage, Nebby shone brighter and worked harder. As Nebby worked with all its might, something magical happened. The first little star sparked to life, glowing warmly in the cold space. Then another and another. Stars, just like our sun, started to form, each one a massive ball of gas burning hot and bright thanks to the processes that Nebby started. Soon, there were many little stars, their light joining together to shine even brighter against the dark. Seeing the friends work together to create a beautiful area in space full of colorful gases and a field of stars, the space monster realized its darkness could serve a noble purpose. By making the surrounding space even darker, it could contrast the bright lights of the stars, enhancing their beauty and making them shine even more vibrantly. Embracing its new role, the space monster became Nebby's neighbor in space. Together, Nebby, its star friends, and the dark space monster filled space with a beautiful scene, making it a place where everyone can shine together in their own way. The darkness of the space monster only served to highlight the beauty of Nebby's stars, creating a breathtaking panorama that could be admired from worlds afar. The end.